Hey guys, this is Karen with Hampton Team Paranormal, and I'm here at my house all alone. Everybody has uh, taken off for a bit. <coughs> uh, I just wanted to do like a little, uh, sorry, it's a little bit of my smoke. I wanted to do a little bit of uh, reason why we haven't been investigating and stuff. I did do a short invest. I don't know if you guys seen that, but did anybody just see something? It could be dust. Let's try it. I'll have to check back on it, but I swear it looked like a bow a lot just went towards my head. Are you here with us now? If so, you popped in pretty fastly. There is a little bit of dust flurries and stuff coming through, but that come like right here. Uh, if you guys did see it, once this video goes out, please comment on it. So since we got that, just to uh, be on the safe side, we'll go ahead and do a <clears throat> an EVP session with my Rec Forge, <clears throat> and then we'll listen back to it. EVP session number one at my home. Was that you that I just seen pass to the left of me? And above me, I got goosebumps bad guys, but it could be just because I seen that. And it almost had its own glow to it or something. Can you make a noise if that's you? Can you make a very loud noise? Can you knock like this? Can you tell me what your name is, please? Are you behind me? Yes or no? Can you touch me? Do you have the energy to touch me, like right here? Or even move this twig? On the count of three? One, two, three. Okay, thank you. We're going to listen back to this. I keep seeing crap flying. See? I'm not moving, but just a bit. And even if I was... I can see the duck. There is nothing moving over there, guys. Absolutely nothing. There's nobody here but me. I swear. You guys always know I tell the truth. And I'll even show you around the house if you want me to. Let's listen to this and see what we got. Hopefully they spoke clear enough for us to understand them. Listen back to it. EVP session number one at my home. Was that you that I just seen? To manipulate, to manipulate my machine. Wait, to manipulate my machine. Uh -oh. Listen. Was that you that I just seen pass to the left of me and above me? I got goosebumps, bad guys, but it could be just because I seen that, and it almost had its own glow to it or something. Can you make a noise if that's you? Can you make a very loud noise? Can you knock like this? Can you tell me what your name is, please? Are you behind me? Yes or no?
can you touch me? Do you have the energy to touch me, like right here, or even move this twig? On the count of three. One, two, three. Thank you. I don't know. I have to listen back to it, but I thought I heard a yes, but there's a... I don't know what's going back here, and this is the corner, and then over in this area. But when I said the thing about the knock, it sounded like something taking its finger and tapping just one time on the TV screen. Um, I'm going to go cut this heat off and check to make sure nobody's here. I'm going to turn my camera that way while I'm gone and see if we can catch something. <clears throat> if you're not afraid to show yourself over there where you've been showing orbs and stuff, uh, could you please do that for me while I step out for just a second? I won't be watching you. Can you show us a big, bright, beautiful orb, please? Here, guys, let me uh, do this also. Sorry about stepping in front of the camera. We're going to set the EMF over here. Can you come over here and make that light up where all your beautiful orbs were? I mean, if, if that is you, I will step away so that I don't interfere. And then I've got this ball that lights up. If you would like to even maybe push this off put it right here. It's right on the edge. Shouldn't be much to tip it that way or to just move it that way. Okay? I'll give you a few seconds. If you'll please do that for me, I'll be right back. Let me see if I've got that in the frame. Come on, try and show us some. Your orbs. Did you tap on my TV screen? Okay. It's very... Okay, now it's not blurry. I mean, you're welcome to stand in front of my camera long enough to move the ball or turn off, turn the EMF on. Uh, but please don't stand in it too long to where you, you're blurring it up now. Can you please back away a second? If you're in front of my camera, please back off a second. I ask you nicely and respectfully. Okay, my light's just flickered on my camera. Come on. Back away a second. Please. Or, or go ahead and move the ball. Let's move it over here and see if it changes anything with the... See, guys? It's focused in. What's it trying to focus in on? Right there. Okay. Okay, come on. I'm going to step over here a minute. Turn off this heat. So we can hear. Can you show yourself? Can you show yourself uh, into a shadow, possibly? Move the ball, do something. Do you have the energy to do it? Did you tap on my TV right there? I don't know if you guys heard it. It was during the recording, so it was really hard to actually... I heard it with my own ears, but, you know, doesn't do you guys any good if you don't hear it yourself. Okay, we're going to leave those things there. And then back it up a little. Okay, so maybe you guys can see if the EMF... The EMF goes off. It should be... I'll show you if I can. You should be able to see the blinking. Yeah. Come close to this, please. Oh my gosh, 
what the hell I mean. Guys, that's nothing paranormal. It's actually, uh, it's actually just a lot that I have half rigged up there. I mean, I hadn't got it taped down or anything yet, so. <clears throat> let me see. Uh, let me fix my camera. Okay, hopefully you guys can see the ball and the EMF back there. And what is that? Guys, I'm not the type of investigator that thinks that, um, how would you say it, uh, orbs and stuff are very, uh, totally legit in an investigation just because of the fact that, you know, they're, they're so hard to prove that they're actually anything, such as a ball of energy or whatever, but that is weird. I mean, I got a little bit of flurries when I first started right in here, but over there, I don't know. Okay, so I think we got some stuff on the, the EVP player. So, um, how about we try a spirit box session? Uh, and I bet you my son's got my auxiliary cord outside, so let me see if I've got another one in case. Got the front door locked, dogs outside, all that good stuff. Just so hopefully nobody bothers us. But if so, then of course, guys, you know I'm going to have to uh, stop the investigation, of course. <laughs> guys, I'm going to have to buy a new uh, battery pack for my camera because, you know, I thought all this time the spirits, and they may had at first, but... The spirits had been draining my battery, but honestly, I think I just need a new battery pack, so we're going to try to get a quick session of this in. It's only giving me like 10 minutes on this, and it's crazy, but uh, let's see what we can get. So, input see if we can get anything to communicate before I got to stop this. Are you the orbs that are flying behind me? Can you make the EMF for the ball fly off? Do you have enough energy? You don't? Can you at least tell me your name? I'm sorry, I cut you off before I heard that. Can you say it again? Can you please tell me your name? My name's Karen. I come with all due respect. You do not have to speak to me. This is only if you want to. but can you please try to speak a little clearer? So we can understand you? What is your name? My dog is barking, but he's outside. Back there where my TV is, where the white light is, is there any possible way you can show yourself like a shadow or like a face in that area?
Are you able to? Okay guys, I don't know what all we got. I mean, I'll have to review it and everything, and then of course I'll do an update. Because, I mean, I'm seriously... Start out 33 minutes, I'm down to a minute. So it's got to be my battery pack. But, uh, yeah, I'll give you just a few more seconds to show yourself behind me, however you wish to do so. If you're uh, over here, over here... Let the public know that you do exist. Can you do that for me? Make a loud noise that they can hear? Yell something in that camera? Or I'm right here by myself and I can't cut it off unless I go to the back. Can you cut it off? On the count of three? All you gotta do is push the red button behind it. One. Two. Three. You make a loud noise, please. Thank you very much. I hope that was you in the orbs we've seen. The light of the Lord surrounds me. The love of the Lord enfolds me. And the power of the Lord protects me. In Jesus' name, if anything is evil... And all other spirits that have happened to enter and communicate must leave the property since this session's over with. So goodbye. Thank you for communicating. Okay, guys. Well, like I said, I'm red lighting already after 18 minutes, which isn't good. But I'm going to work on getting me a new battery pack, a new camera. You know, things are starting to look up for us now. Uh, new investigations coming ahead, I promise y'all. And um, God bless you all. Keep following, keep subscribing. You know, comments are great. I don't care how funny they are, how non-legit they are, whatever. But go ahead, keep leaving them. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next go-around, hopefully soon. So, God bless you and have a great, safe weekend. Oh, and we did change our name from Hampton Team Paranormal, KJJ, to Hampton Paranormal. We shortened it a little bit. That way it's easier, you know, it's just easier. But anyway, God bless you all, and have a great, safe weekend.